right, go west. Peter Cox and Richard Drummy, how long have you two known one another? About 12 or 13 years. Still put up with each other? Just about. This yeah. man is breathless. Would you, <laughs> would you introduce me, please, Richard, to the lady on the end over here? It's Mo Birch. Mo Birch on the vocal sound. Right. And uh, let's see, right here in front, striped shirt. It's Mr. Alan Murphy. Alan, uh, would you move over a little bit, Alan? We'll see the man behind. Peter Adams. Uh, the drummer, would you stand, sir, so we can see you? That's Mr. Jimmy Copley. And last but not least. Well, this name rhymes. This on the bass here, all the way from Bonnie, Scotland, Mr. Jazz Lockery. There you go. Welcome to American Bandstand. Why do you write songs about things that are not in your, not in your lifetime? Well, uh, this is the second album now. The first album was really an album full of love songs where I'm singing about how sad I am that my baby's left me. So this time we just look for something more interesting lyrically to write about. Is this a total collaboration? Yeah, it really is. It really is. <laughs> You're locked at the hip. Yeah, my, I mean, we, we, write, <laughs> we share the music and we even sit down and write the words together, which is quite a strange way of going about it, but... You know. It doesn't happen very often. Yeah, we like to do things the hard way, really. Gentlemen and lady, thank you very much for joining us. Would you sign our autograph wall, please? This is Go West, ladies and gentlemen.